All right, Chris Wayne joining me now with a look at the week that's looking pretty good. Yeah, next couple days, clear skies. Mm -hmm. It was the Hummel lawn mowers and the smell of fresh cut grass. Catching up with all that uh, rain. I think a lot of people are today, yeah. And if you didn't, maybe the grass is looking a little bit long. You got a couple more days to get this done. No pressure. You could take your time, but I'd probably get it done by Thursday before we get some rain in here by Friday. Rundle Mills, clear skies so far, and that momentum's going to hold. We have a high pressure system in control, and that keeps us dry and clear uh, over the next couple days. We're back to sunshine tomorrow morning. Here's why that high pressure system we've been talking about spinning away just to our northwest, uh, keeping skies clear, not only across Maryland, but really region wide. Okay, occasionally you get a, a cloud or two in place, but uh, this will keep us dry for the next uh, couple days at least. Let me plan it out on Futurecast. There's your timestamp up top as we go toward Tuesday morning. Starting today off with uh, sunshine, dry skies, calm wind, and temperatures cool at first, warming up by the afternoon. Talking starting the day in the low 60s for most, but by the time we get to 3, 4 p.m. right around here, broken cloud deck sunshine getting through and highs back in the low to mid 80s for most. That's about 10 degrees above average, so we're running very warm for early October. We'll get back into the mid 70s by the end of the week. Wednesday stays dry, still warm here, uh, but eventually working our way more toward fall temperatures. Let me go bigger picture for a moment. We'll pick up where we left off. Skies stay clear really the next couple days. Kind of working through this fast because we're talking Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Skies stay dry. There's that yard work opportunity, but you see the spoiler off to the west. Those are showers that will eventually make their way in. Friday starts off dry. That's where we're at here on Futurecast now early Friday morning, uh, but know that that rain is on the way. That's a cold front that comes through and drops our temperatures. The uh, outlook for the six to 10 day range just beyond the seven day forecast. Pretty easy to tell that we got a good shot at being below average by then. So from the low 80s next couple of days back to highs in the 60s for most as we get into early next week. Here's a look at your seven day forecast. Temperatures in the mid 80s Tuesday, Wednesday. That's well above normal for this time of year and we hold in the mid 70s around average for this time of year Thursday, Friday. We bring in that late day rain chance. Showers look uh, likely for the, uh, the late afternoon, early evening, overnight and into Saturday morning. That's when that cold front fully comes through. And then we'll go from 70 to 49 for an overnight low. Temperatures in the mid 60s Sunday and Monday. That'll be the fall like feel I think a lot of people have been looking for and maybe even then some, Kelly. 